Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. In this video, we're going to be taking a look again at Safe Moon. Can this actually do a 100x from the price that it is today? If this sounds interesting to you, please drop that like. It, well, yeah, drop a like. <laughs> Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. And I'm going to dive into this with you. But before I do so, I need to let you know I'm not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on the market. So please always do your own research before investing any money. That being said, you know, I was looking at SafeMoon because obviously if you was uh, paying attention to my last video, I had invested into SafeMoon, but I only invested a small amount that I can afford to lose. And, you know, since investing into them, I've been keeping an eye on my balance because, like I said, they focus heavily on this 10% uh, burn thing, right? Where if you sell your safe moon to try and take some profits, they're taking 10%, but 5% of that is going back into people that are holding this coin. And I've been seeing my balance rise and I've received roughly, I think I, think I got this right, about three, uh, 3 million safe moon tokens for free which probably right about now works out about 70 pence let me just check this to be precise um 3,000 30,000 300,000 you're looking at about 70 pence now in a sense if uh, there's a few things i need to really try and figure out before we can decide if we can go to 100x and the first one for me is clearly that they're working on a, def uh, a way to uh, burn the supply and obviously decrease the supply total like my words are just going all over the place what i'm trying to get at is that how in my head i have a, a, a thought of how low is it actually going to go like what's the final supply going to be because they haven't really made that clear and when i look on the white paper for me like i like a white paper to be a bit more precise in relation to their coding you know because we can't see because you've got to remember this is a DeFi coin and it's a great roadmap for, to look at you know because it shows the roadmap it shows so i said it's a great roadmap <laughs> well it's a great white paper to look at because it shows the roadmap and it, and it talks about other little things that it's doing the static burning and everything else right uh oh sorry <laughs> did i say static burning no 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 static rewards <laughs> it talks about what it can do but it doesn't actually show you like how their coding is so my coding my words ain't coming out i ain't cutting nothing anyway what i'm trying to get at is that it's a DeFi coin and most DeFi coins that i've seen recently especially on the binance smart chain and i'm not saying safe moon will do this because if i didn't if i thought that for any reason they were scam or anything like that i would not be investing into it but it's in you know they do this thing called a rug pull and they don't really show us the coding now they don't, in all fairness you know these companies or projects they don't have to show you anything but some some are more transparent than others and sometimes transparency can help your project a long way and i don't know maybe they've got it up on their their discord or somewhere else but you know that would be good to sort of see on their website because for me like you know you want to know if they've removed this this code called the migrator code now pancake swap still have uh, still has this it means that they could do this thing called a rug pull on you and imagine standing on a rug and then someone pulling it <laughs> and then you fall over and bang your head it's basically like that they're pulling the money from underneath you meaning once they receive enough money they can pull it now i'm not saying that the, uh, this actual project is going to do that i'm just saying that it's good to sort of be transparent with uh, those sort of things but moving forward right because uh, these are the things that you have to ask yourself if it's going to go to 100x you know because 100x you're talking like a big jump and there's a lot of noise happening on tiktok apparently apparently with safe moon and i look at these things i look at the the hype around it and I, I do need to break it down. And I need to take into consideration that the supply is burning significantly. Now, when I look at the last video that I did, a couple of days ago, it was about 389 trillion that had been burnt. <laughs> and uh, what am I laughing for? Anyway, but that was in the space of two weeks or something, because it hasn't been out long on coin market cap. You're talking March the 9th. And uh, well, three, three weeks ish, something like that. And if that's how much they can burn in the space of three weeks, you know, I asked that question before how much more can they burn going forward because right now it says uh where is it here you go 393 so from where are we to what did i say before it was before let me just uh, see that video again 389 391 they burn an extra four trillion coins in the space of two days i think that's right from 389 to 
393, you're looking at roughly 4 trillion. So, and here's my question as well, like, because you're, you're burning uh, 10%. And let me just get this up because I think it's important for us to really understand. I'm going to get dive into like the, you know, what kind of prices we can see in a second. But this whole burning thing, we really need to grasp our head around it because you need to have, a, we, we, we need to sort of see or know how much lower this can go. And what what's it going to sort of stabilize that? Because I've read some uh, comments from other people saying that, you know, this isn't a new thing. There's been coins that have been trying to do something like this for a long time where the the coin supply burns and some of them or most of them have failed. Now I want to know why they failed. If you know, drop your comments down below and let me know. Share it with everyone else so we uh, we can all figure out why they failed. This one seems to be working at the moment. And yeah, I mean, how much lower will this go to? How is it going to work out? Is it going to work out that everybody whoever's holding whatever amount, that's the final supply that will be left? I don't know because you know that's what I'm trying to figure out like we need to have an understanding of what the final supply will be and once we get that then we can truly work out how much higher you can uh, uh, the price can go and how much more money can be made because you best believe as the coins burn your su supply rises and the the, um, the expense meaning the, the uh, price rises with it too so you know your coins that you're receiving like i said this three million pound uh, so three million tokens which is sitting at 69 pence now could go to six pounds or 60 quid it could be worth a lot more as time goes on so this is something to really pay attention to now for me i look at this like a way of staking i've got to because <laughs> you're take you're buying tokens you're holding it in a wallet and then you're receiving tokens free if you're not if you're not selling it and just holding it it's like it's almost like staking or another form of staking i don't know if they want to call it something else but it is almost like a form of staking because you're receiving coins for free and obviously those are the coins that other people are burning you're receiving five percent of that so it's interesting let's work this out because if it was to do 100x right now you can't see the market cap on these uh, coin uh say coin market cap and coin gecko <laughs> say get my words all mixed up but uh, it shows on the website. You can see here. Let's just grab it up real, uh, real quick. We click on this. The market cap size. Where is it? Here we go. So right now they're saying it's 193 million. 0.78. I'm going to copy this because for me, actually, no, I can't copy it. Can I? I need to put it in manually. Uh, what I'm trying to get at is I want to. I want to see how much higher it can go. We're talking 100x, right? 193 million, 780,000. Uh, that's what we're talking right now. Let me copy this. This is the price of the market cap or the size of the market uh, market cap right now. How much higher would it be if we did 100x? You're talking 100 times the, the market cap size. You'd be looking at a 19 billion dollar market cap. Now that is doable, especially if this is going to get a lot of hype behind it and a lot of people are going to support uh, support the project. And they actually stick to their roadmap and do what they're going to do. Because, you know, they're talking about implementing things like NFTs. You know, Safe Moon OG NFT conceptualization. I think I said that right. <laughs> and down here to the moon, you know, we enter the NFT marketplace and staking. So, yeah, essentially what I'm saying, it is like staking. Unless, and, but here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? They're saying Q4 staking. But again, for me, it feels like I'm already staking because I'm receiving coins for free. You see? So, what, they're, they're going to be implementing another way of staking it to make it even more? So, hold on, you're telling me that you guys are going to do a thing where... I'm talking to you guys now, Safe Moon, if you're watching this. <laughs> and if anyone knows them, just tag them in this. You're telling me that we're receiving money through burning people burning their tokens. And on top of that, you're going to create a thing where we can stake the tokens that we have to make more tokens. Because if that happens, my God you will see people jump on this like crazy because it's all about generating a passive income and i've been saying this for the longest time on my channel with most of these coins like the harmonies like the zillicas like the thetas as well by the way because you can be staking theta for a passive income i know about this trust me because <laughs> i'm doing it <laughs> and yeah you know if if you're going to be be doing what these guys are doing and offering the staking then it will definitely change the game and I think the 100x can be possible. And, you know, the 19 billion, it can happen faster than we think. Who knows? I'm just going to keep an eye on the roadmap and see what, what they achieve. You know, you guys should put like a little tick box or something just to show us where you are and if you've done it, you know, so we can see it more clearly. I know you guys are still fresh. I know you're still new. Like I said, it's, it's only been on since the 9th, 9th of March, 8th of March on CoinMarketCap. 
But if you were to do 100x, like I said, when we see a 19 billion dollar market cap, 19.3 billion dollar market cap, you can essentially take this price here and shimmy it across twice, because essentially your your times it by 10, times it by 100, you move the decimal forward twice. Simple math, you know. Uh, so you'd be looking at a price of 0, 0, 0. 0. 0. 0. 0. 2, four zeros and a two. Now, if you was to invest today, and again, usually I like to say a thousand pounds for the average person, but I've got to keep it super real because it is a new coin and new coins are risky. Again, this is not financial advice. I can only show you realistic data. I can only show you what, what they show me to work with. Like I said, I'm showing you the market cap. Please do more research before you do this. Because like I said, we need to see the code. Guys, if if you can reach out to them as well, maybe say to them, look, show us your code. I don't know, do they have a GitHub? A GitHub? Because <laughs> I call it GitHub. My mum calls it GitHub. What is GitHub? Because <laughs> she's African, right? Go and look on their GitHub for this thing. If they don't show it, I'm not happy with them. Okay, mommy. <laughs> okay, talking too much. What I'm saying is that they should have this for us to be able to see. And when I look up here, there's no GitHub. There's a Reddit telegram unless they got it in the telegram i don't know they should show the coding because i want to know if you've removed the migrator code because if you have for me that is a thumbs up because then i feel more safe knowing that you can't just pull a rug pull on my rass <laughs> what am i laughing for anyway because that's important for me anyway like you know, i've been talking about the gooses and the the ape swaps they removed the, the migrator code so you know again you have to remember this is DeFi. we're talking DeFi. Um, I don't even know if this comes up in the DeFi uh, station. Let me just see, because uh, I don't know. <laughs> I haven't even checked this for a while. Does it even show up in the DeFi station? Let's just have a look. Um, I don't think it does. Safe Moon, you're not in there yet. Yet. Unless you are, and you're just somewhere down below. I don't know. All I know is you're DeFi and you're on uh, Binance. Let's just check that radar as well to see if you're on here. What's this automatic link? Let me just click BSC, because they are on here. Well, they're on the Binance Smart Chain, so they should be up in these charts at some point, sooner rather than later, I don't know, time will tell. They're not on here yet. I'm going to keep an eye on it, because this is the sort of coin that will just sneak up, <laughs> and the next thing is sitting in number two place, or, or number one. Like this, look, BNB stakes, you know what I'm saying? These coins, they just like fly up into the charts. Anyway, let's just work this out, because like I said, if you invested, and again, not investment advice, I've got to keep it real. Maybe 100 or 200 pounds. I wouldn't do more than 200 pounds if you're new to the game, you know, you're new into the industry or you're someone that has been around for a while and wants to invest in Safe Moon. I wouldn't do more than 200, not to begin with anyway. And if you were going to do it, I'd do it slowly over time because then you got you give yourself that time to learn more about the project and understand what they're doing, seeing if they're going to actually hit their target goals. You know, I really do believe that if it does what it says it can do, 19 billion is not a lot. And I know it sounds like a lot, but it's achievable, especially in this bull market with three times more the people in the industry. Bit of silence there. <laughs> and, you know, people, you know, people be investing, money be coming in, institutions are involved. What if, what if one of these big institutions really look deep? They do, and I'm talking they start to dive down the rabbit hole because I've been down the rabbit hole <laughs> in this DeFi space with the dApps and stuff and the, all the sorts. I've been down the rabbit hole. I'm still in the rabbit hole. <laughs> I don't know if you are, but when you when you buy into this, you're coming down the rabbit hole. <laughs> Plain and simple. Because it's not easy to buy. Because you have to go on them pancake swaps or any kind of swaps to, to get this, this uh, coin. Where's my... I'm trying to get it up. Pancake. That's going down the rabbit hole. Because you got to know how to add their uh, thingy code, which is here, their Binance Smart Chain uh, contract address you got to put that in pancake look i'm showing you how to do it now <laughs> if you want to buy this you go into pa uh, pancake swap which means you come down the rabbit hole <laughs> you come into here you select the currency and then you paste the contract address i've already done it it's there you can see right and then you can obviously pull it in and then choose how much you want to buy but when you buy right you got to use you got to pay with bnb to do the, the payment you have to click on the, the little cog here and change your slippage. I used 14. You can try less. You can probably try 11. Some people have been saying they've been uh, been able to buy Safe Moon with 11 
a percent slippage. Now remember, changing the slippage will obviously decrease how much you get because you're talking paying a higher fee so you can get your payment in faster and quicker at a higher price. That's basically what it is. But if you just leave it at one or 0 0.5, <laughs> you're not going to get your payment through. It's that, it's that simple. So right now, that's the only way to be buying, as far as I'm aware, to be buying SafeMoon. Some people have been saying Trust Wallet or you trust, Whatever it is, if you can get it on there, great. Cool. Drop your comments down below, let people know. But yeah, like, if you invested £200, which, by the way, let me show you in dollars. £200 in dollars is uh, $275, 59 cents. You would get 80, uh, sorry, let me get this number. 869,565,200 pounds. Tokens, right? Let's copy this because if it did a hundred X and then it went to the price of, like I said, zero 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 two two three oh six, because obviously you shuffle it forward. So if you hear zero 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 two three oh six, let's take this because you basically take your coins, which is that eight hundred and sixty nine million, times it by point zero 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 zero. Two, I'm gonna be precise. Two, three, or six, because this is what we're talking about. We want to know precision. Precision. You would get a total of twenty thousand and fifty-two pounds. That is mad. Turning two hundred pounds into a potential twenty thousand pounds is mad. I don't know anywhere where you can take two hundred pounds and then turn it into twenty thousand. Whilst you're just, I was, gonna, I was gonna say just chilling. But then the shirt came out and it sounded like I was going to say just shitting. <laughs> I've not got <quite> nothing. <laughs> okay, too much. But what I'm saying is, that is mad gains whilst you're just chilling. <laughs> Playing your Animal Crossings or your Call of Duties or Fortnites or Apex. Because I know about Apex. Whilst you're just watching Netflix. I don't even know what's on Netflix right now, but you're watching it. Them documentaries. Whilst you're just chilling, hoovering your house, or in America they say vacuum, right? Vacuuming your floor, washing up your dishes on the side because your kid, your kids keep making a mess and not cleaning them up. Go and sort the dishes, <laughs> mummy. But I'm playing with my doll. If you don't, you're gonna stand on the stairs. <laughs> okay, I'm laughing too much because <laughs> because okay, it's too much because parents <laughs> parents parent their kids differently like my mum oh if you don't listen to my mum african nigerian what are you doing <laughs> mommy leave me alone are you mad where is my broom <laughs> where is my broom go and get the broom i will beat you so hard <laughs> because african parents parent their kids different they just whack you with a broom just throw a slipper at your head <laughs> Just get a sock and just pull it around your head. <laughs> they just don't care. Whereas the, you know, the white folk, meaning, because, hey, listen, my nan's white, right? So I can say whatever, because i got a white, I'm half, I'm mixed race. But, my, you know, the white people, they, they, they're a bit more calm. Like, you know, go and stand on the stairs. Go and stand on the stairs. You can stay there for five minutes. Nope, you're five years old. Five minutes. <laughs> Me? Go to your room. <laughs> don't come out till next week. <laughs> If you come out without my permission, I will beat you. <laughs> okay, mommy. <laughs> okay, I'm talking far too much. <laughs> Just laugh with me because life's too short and we need to learn to laugh. I think... <laughs> I think that $19 billion market cap is possible. And again, a £200 investment to make £20,000 is nice. I'd be happy with that. And if you are someone that wants to make more, because like I said, a thousand pounds for me is risky on a brand new DeFi coin. But if you put a thousand pounds, you'd be times in this essentially by 10. And my God, you'd be making uh, 200,000 pounds, which is crazy money. Mad. Ludicrous. No, no, no. What is it? Let me get back. <laughs> Mad. Crazy. Ludicrous. Boom. That's it. I need, to say, I need to get that right. I can't mess that up. I'm going to make a t-shirt on that as well because... I need a t-shirt for that because I just love it. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here. I've spoken too much. I like Safe Moon so far. Time will tell what it does. 
you guys keep an eye on the burn supply because I need to know and if someone already knows please tell me what's going to be the final supply for this coin what's it going to be sitting on because if it's burnt 393 trillion in less than a month I can only imagine in another because look you're talking <laughs> the reported supply is 642 trillion and it's already burnt 300 trillion of the one quadrillion so in four months all the supply will be gone <laughs> Apart from mine, yours, his, hers. So it should be really, really low, technically speaking. And if that's the case, prices should rise. And like I said, if you're, it is like staking. You're receiving tokens. They should rise in price as well. Something to think about. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, become a patron of mine because they can see exactly when I buy and sell, when I plan to take profits. I break it down with them. I show them my little spreadsheets that show prices of when I plan to sell, what price, uh, how much I'm going to sell, percentages, and how much profit I will make, things like this. You don't want to miss this because if you if you are one of these people that are watching this market and then the, <laughs> you watch it for too long and then the price falls on your face, you're going to be upset that you did not take profits. And I do that with them so they can see. Are you ready for Let me find my phone. Hold on. Where's my phone? Why do I always need my phone? Oh, I'm not even going to lie. I can't even find my phone. I need to start keeping it. I apologize, guys. I haven't got my phone with me. It must be in the living room somewhere. But, you know, shout out to my patrons. All of you, thank you so, so much. I see you. And the new patrons, I see you. Thank you so, so much. Where's my damn phone? I need that. I just went to the shop. I hope I haven't left it on the side. I better not have. Anyway, thank you guys. Shout out to you. Shout out to you guys for watching as well. I apologize. I will try and keep on top of it. I need to look for my phone now because it's worrying me. And uh, yeah, big up to you all. And I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Cheers.